Get over to our man, Mr. Basil Chapman, as we do each and every Tuesday at 20 past the hour. And don't forget, folks, Basil has an outstanding show here every trading day, 10 to 11 Eastern Standard Time. And, of course, he has this great news, uh, the opening call. Now, it's very easy to get the opening call, folks. Come over to our website at TFNN. You're going to go into newsletters. You'll see the opening call right on the left-hand side. You can get the opening call for one month for $149. You can get it for six months for $6.95, which is a savings of $199, or 22%. You can get it for one year for $5.95, for $11.95, which is a savings of $593, or 33%. Now, they all come with a 30-day money-back guarantee. So come on over, check it out. If it works for you, great. If it doesn't work for some reason, bottom line, just you can get your money back 29th day. Basil Chapman, what's going on? Hi, Tom. How are you? I'm doing great. Yourself? I'm good. I'm just looking out the window. I'm seeing some clouds. I hope it doesn't rain in the next two hours because I want to be out there playing tennis. I like Other it. Than that, I like it. What can I say? That's right. Right. So what is it? Is it in the 80s, 90s? Where, where are we at? It's, it's quite warm, yeah. Okay. It's pretty okay. Warm. Actually, it's quite humid. That's the thing. Yeah. Your, fr your first cold spell is going to be coming in any day now, though. I can always, it's all, it happens up there, folks, it, it, and it feels so great when it comes in. But, I mean, we're getting there. It's the 22nd of August. It better be coming in. <laughs> <You're> right. <laughs> so. So talk about coming in. We've got the Dow coming in uh, so from the high that was made uh, in the middle of August at uh, 34,281. When I look at the speed of the pullback, the suddenness, uh, we've been talking about that for at least two weeks. We've been saying just be careful. There could be a, quite a sharp pullback. And the daily chart, what is really impressive is that the weekly chart has had a buy signal instituted. It's not yet a buy mode, which means that you should go to at least four higher peaks, but we're at a potential peak B here. And, and the technicals are still very strong, uh, even on this pullback. So I'm looking at the shorter term, and one of the reasons why we've stayed in our core long position in the diamonds, where we did add a couple of days ago, we did add the short side of it, and that will be for new subscribers. That will be a new position. But for older subscribers, they know that this is really a, a, a trade. We're just trying to ameliorate the uh, any pullback in our long positions. Uh, it's slightly more weighted to the short side, uh, but that's the way we're looking at it. And one of the things that's important is you were talking about the dollar just a moment ago. Yes. What's always fascinating to me is how does the market know? You know we, we've looked at markets now for Oh, for decades, and, and it's just incredible how, especially over the last year and a half to the last, especially the last six to eight months, how many times we get almost an exact double top I potential, know. two pennies from the previous high, so the dollar, which we still long from 2018, actually, um, that's the year 2018, uh, at 90 level, is at a at 108.61. It hit 109.29 on the 19th of July, Pull back pretty sharply, not, I mean, sharply just in this chart pattern formation to 104.64 on the 10th of August and then ran up very quickly. And today, what did it do? It went to within two ticks of that high of the 19th of July. But what I am looking at, the MACD is good. <clears throat> the nine period strongly over the 14 period moving average. The stochastic is fabulous at 94%. The relative strength is pretty good in the daily chart. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let me just have something to drink here. And the, and the weekly chart. Oh, that tasted good. <laughs> <laughs> did. I needed that lubrication. And the weekly chart has made this U-shaped pattern that we're always looking at. And the monthly chart only needs to go three ticks higher than today's high. It needs to go to 109.30 okay. to ex extend the monthly leg C. So that, I mean, that's just a perfect use of the Chapman wave in terms of looking at um, the material that we have with cup formations. That's what I always spend a lot of time on my webinars, talk a lot about the cup formations or the arch formations, the timing from the left side to the right side. How our objective is always to get to at least a peak D, how we can use an alternate count to, to at least be prepared for some kind of a pullback. So this is an important moment just in price for the dollar, but really 
the strength uh, on the technical side that it says even if it pulls back, it, sh it should at least try to bump into the, the 109s again. So that's, I just wanted to say, you know, in my work with the left side, right side price time match, looking at the matching price, it's a little lopsided in price because the cup bottom is more to the right. So it's kind of a lopsided cup, but it has all, all the same potential plus the Chapman Wave inside wedge target resistance line right here said that today should be the test of 109.29 and it was so those things are working so it's very interesting we took a lot of money off the table in the, in the last week or two because we were looking at some kind of at least shorter term topping uh, formation so now we're out of our soxl that's three times long the uh, semiconductors we're hoping actually to get back in on this pullback and maybe keep a core position of just the SMHs and then treat anything more than that as a trading position. So we built up some cash. We've taken a little bit off the our three times long, the QQQ, still long, but we took a, a, a bunch off with very, very good profits. But what's what's really fascinating to me is that if you're, if you're fortunate enough to have picked an area that is still in favor, then that the residual strength, as we can see, for instance, CF Industries, I spoke to you about this a little while ago, about this pattern, the stalk leg formation in the Chapman Wave in the daily chart. This is a company, hydrogen, nitrogen products, clean energy, fertilizer, emissions abatement, kind of everything that is being spoken about now. So we're along from the 75s. It had 110.95 today. But the same pattern that I'm looking at, this cup formation, said that the left side high of 113.49 on April the 13th, plummeting down to the 79.18 area on the 14th, and then it turned up and we, we went along, along soon after that. Uh, actually, no, uh, we were along, sorry, we were, we were along at 95. So 95, and now it's trading at 109.15. This particular pattern with the oval pattern says if it breaks to the upside, if it extends more than a one-to-one -one from the oval pattern of what I call the body, then there's a chance that it's actually taken on a one-to-one -one formation that can go quite a bit higher. Well, the target is the 113 area. Today, it's almost hit 111, so it's getting very close. But look at this nice, look at the, the pattern in the cup formation, the symmetry. How you can yes. see, you see this large arch, how it used the 200 period. I've had webinars on the 200 period moving average. Look how many times it hit it, never really broke it by much, always closed above it, and then boom, it took off. So these are patterns that we look at all the time. And most importantly, um, it seems to be in an area that's, that's actually working right now and has continued in the last few days when the general markets have been weak. And you've got the cup formation in the uh, weekly chart. And if it breaks to above 113.59, uh, that will be a leg D in the uh, monthly chart. And that'll be very positive. So we've got a few of those. We had another one as well um, in, in this particular area. And that was uh, uh, NFE, which is in the natural gas area. And that's also gone to a peak D and made a beautiful cup formation, you can see. So that's what we're trying to do, use, use patterns to trade and keep keep uh, keep cash ready for big pullbacks. Jump over to the website, folks. Check out the opening call. Bazz, have a great one. Safe one. Look for a show tomorrow. Thank you, Tom. If you, you want to take advantage.